In our community directory, we have hundreds of listings of free or low cost groups, activities, services and helplines. Finding what you want is easy. Select the council area where you live. Then choose a category for the help or type of service you're looking for. You can choose more than one location, but you can only choose one category at a time. Results are displayed in two tabs, local and national. Some results in the local listings may show organisations which are not physically located in your area or have a head office address elsewhere. However, if they appear in your search, it means that their services are available to residents in your area. Click on the breadcrumbs to go back to your search results. You can change your search by simply selecting a new category. Or by removing one of the filters. If you want to remove all of the filters, the quickest way is just to click on the community directory button in the main navigation bar. Although the most accurate and relevant results will be shown if you select a location and or a category, you can also use the search bar. This will work best if you type in just a keyword or two rather than typing in a question. For example, you may be looking for support with a specific condition, such as COPD. When you want to clear your search criteria from the search bar, just press the reset button. You can combine using the search bar with selecting categories. For example, if you wanted to find bereavement support for someone with a learning disability. or you can search by a specific location. For example, if you wanted to find a church or religious group in a specific town. If you want to save some of these details for yourself or for someone else, you can add any of these listings to your favorites by pressing add to my favorites. Once you have added your listings, go to the My Favourites button at the top of the page. You will then be able to email this favourites list to yourself or to someone else by selecting Email link to this list. Simply fill in your name, the recipient's email address or your own and a short message and press Finish. You can also email this to yourself or to someone else as a customised booklet. Simply add the name of the recipient, your name, a short message if you'd like, the email address you'd like it to go to. You will need to select I am not a robot where you will be asked to select images with a criteria. Verify this and then press send booklet.